Remember the first town to count a while ago of the beer brewing Wisconsin tradition that then leads to beer bottling? Well, two weeks ago, Fox 11's Bill Miston brewed a batch as part of a new exhibit at the Neville Public Museum. Well, today, he went back to bottle it up. Here's a Fox 11 follow up. So we'll pull these out and dozens of open beer bottles filled with beer, but they're missing one little piece. So we wrapped around there. Congrats, you've just uh, bottled your first beer. <laughs> but if you think it's ready to drink, well, it's not. Let's backtrack a bit. Now, this so, is the part where I don't want to drop this bucket. Two weeks ago, the Neville Public Museum's curator, Kevin Cullen, and I started a batch of German Dunkelweizen, or dark wheat beer. After yeast was added and fermentation took its course over that time, she's alive. Prost. Prost. This is what we're left with. Nice kind of wheat with. Um, yeah, malt, backbone, little hops, which is what you want for that style of beer. But of course, it's flat. Two glass jugs called Carboys are filled with the same beer made with two separate strains of yeast. During fermentation, yeast eats sugar from the grains and converts the sugar to alcohol and carbon dioxide. This beer has about 5% alcohol by volume, but it's flat. Dump them in equal measures. In. So in home brewing, to carbonate it, you add a little bit more sugar during the bottling process. It's a little more fuel for the yeast to then naturally carbonate in the bottle itself. Give it a few pumps. The Neville isn't getting into the brewing business per se, but the museum has upcoming classes called the Cellar Series, two-part classes about brewing and brewing history. Uh, people will be doing this. This is all part of it. This is where really the hands-on element of that class comes in. And this is also probably one of the messier parts of the job. It too. is, you know, you're gonna get some spillage, whoa, like that. After filling all of the bottles with both types and capping them, okay. there's just one more step, nice. and you'll need whole milk. I, I learned this trick from my professor in grad school, um, Bettina Arnold. That's a pretty cool school. I know, right? <laughs> because it's milk has sugar in it, drape it in like this. Cohen says it's perfect for yeah. sticking paper labels to the glass bottles, just dip, wrap, the, the dry, and set aside. Unfortunately, you don't want to drink them yet, as bottle carbonating will take about two weeks. Bill Miston, Fox 11 News. Now, along with the beer brewing and history classes, the Neville is also offering classes on making soda. For more information about the Cellar Series, just head to our website, fox11online.com.